Hey hi hello welcome back to my new video this sampati watch and sampat sam fix youtube channel this is poco xs slash nfc custom rom reviews back with new video and our version is 14 year july 5th 2024 is the security patch kernel user is 4.14.340 open ela kernel has been used this is the typical ui home screen what we can get this is the app drawer and these are the apps pre installed and some of them i have installed and this is the quick settings toggles dolby atmos is also included here in the edit section you also get these options let's check dolby atmos which kind of dolby atmos yeah it's a proper uh, google kind of dolby atmos is available not a moto dolby or xiaomi dolby it's a proper dolby atmos and apps like dialer you get google, google dialer only you will get the direct video call support and also this one call recording but it will announce the other person that you are recording the call camera application kind of gcam this is as you can see you can say gcam mini or anything like that in the video mode okay in the video mode you can actually don't there is no option to select the fs but basic things you can do but if you want anything advanced you always use the gcam ports I always recommend that and we'll close this and settings panel again it remains very similar to any other yes prompts it's very simple as you can see you also get this battery battery manager or battery saver extreme battery saver is not given battery life you can scan have some idea here i can say the battery life is really really good and settings majority of the settings remains very similar you can check out my previous videos into gestures again 100 mode these things are working fine as you can see and navigation mode gesture navigation you will not get that option to increase the pill length and radius it's very tiny anyhow so up to three finger screenshot and other gestures you can check out here into the display again you get that options of colors and refresh rate you get adaptive refresh rate here and dark theme once i apply that it's not in pitch black condition but once you enable that it will be in the pitch black condition i really like this option they have not omitted that dolby atmos i already explained fm radio is also pre included let's see some results what i got in this particular rom starting with and to benchmark this is the latest version 10.2.9 guess relax 78440 i got a score in the pogo x after installing this pixel os july security patch 737 is the single score 1822 is the multi score Android has some 14 links 4.14.340 open ela kernel has been used here multi score could have been better but it's still good i can say geekben 6.3.0 is the version i'm using this is the basic integrity and set is perfect match both getting passed and device is also certified you can use all the sorry use all the payment applications like phone pay google pay all are going to work fine here is there ten support and level 1 certification is there watching oted application is also not a problem in this particular rom this is rated speed test with graph and this is from new oracles and i have 200 mbps atl fiber connection it's pulling up to 240 mbps which is fine charging rapidly turbo charging also is also supported as you can see during 12 18 it is 36 12 29 it is 47 everything is fine let's see the fingerprint unlock speed here as you can see it's quite fast and accurate and face unlock yeah it's also fast and like unlock your smartphone is very smooth here in terms of face and fingerprint unlock i have satisfied better and if i go into lock screen and customizations those are still available other things you can check out my previous videos again the yeah, wallpaper and style lock screen as you can see you will get those customization option but it is getting option here bug maybe uh, let's say vgm how it handles in this particular rom graphics set to only smooth plus ultra here nothing kind of 90 or 60 fps at least let's see how it handles even in the counter attacks i haven't faced any issues as of now yeah there was a lag and i am not getting that high fps count here but it's fine i can say and this is a quick settings toggle so you get here it was smooth and responsive i can't say it's a great but it's still smooth i can say but gaming experience is not that mark based on the 40 fps it's okay 
again this kind of ROM is used for bad guy fund uh, simple usage simple google kind of experience if you want then you can use this ROM yeah this is the volume panel we'll come back here that's the gaming experience and speed test you guys can see everything is working fine guys if you have any specific questions regarding this particular ROM you can comment down in the comment section if you have not join the whatsapp group for this particular video there is a link in the description if you want to follow me on the social media there are links in the description and if you want to uh, subscribe to my channel still you having poco x and not subscribe to my channel subscribe guys and if you still not uh, enable that bell notification enable that and like the video guys i'll be motivated to make similar kind of videos we'll meet you with another interesting video and that keep smiling bye bye for now